tonight at the Bessie Smith Performance Hall, UTC adjunct professor Dr. Clark White, also known as Deacon Blues, discussed the progress of Chattanooga African American history. Local 3 photojournalist Rico Holston takes us there. People in the neighborhood used to laugh because here comes this kid with this lunchbox and this book. This is the last Thursday night for this particular lecture series. Uh, we certainly have enjoyed this particular event. Uh, but we've enjoyed all of them. It was not unusual to go into an African-American school and find a graduate of Columbia or New York University. I was here to discuss education in black Chattanooga from Reconstruction until the present time. I think that we've come a long way, but we have a long way to go in terms of equity of opportunity for people of color and for poor people in the Chattanooga area. This by far has been one of the better ones uh, with Dr. Clark White talking about the segregationists and the segregation in the, in the school system and black Chattanooga. All those categories, the black community you know, seems to be laid behind. I've learned to be very empathetic with my students and I meet my students where they are, but I try to expose them to a broad world and, and get them to answer the very hard questions. I think it's important for everyone to be educated, including African Americans and also white ethnics to be educated in the history of this country, which includes African American history. Here at, here at the Bessie Smith Cultural Center, Chattanooga African American Museum, we continuously tell the stories uh, through our museum effort. Uh, we go into the schools to talk about these things, uh, and we invite the schools and other organizations here to the Bessie Smith Cultural Center uh, to see what we have to offer and to talk about uh, black history uh, 24 hours and, and 365 days a year.